If you want to edit photos on Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra, you can do that by going to gallery. Then in the gallery, we can select a photo that we wish to edit. And then we can press this pen icon over here at the bottom. Now we will find a bunch of different tools that we can go through. I'm going to mention some of them. For example, over here in the middle of the photo, we have the mirror effect rotation and we can also change the aspect ratio. Besides that, we can straighten the photo, make horizontal and vertical adjustments. And here we can also tap on this icon in order to create a gener generative edit or sketch to image where we can sketch something in order to create an image out of it. Besides that, we can go to filters here in order to apply a filter. The middle icon allows you to adjust the light balance, as you can see. We also have the brightness, exposure, contrast, highlights, shadows, saturation, tint, temperature, sharpness, and definition. You can also set it to auto as well. So over here on the left side, as you can see, each option has auto, uh, which we can use if we want to take a look how the device can suggest that suggests uh, can suggest us how to edit the photo. Over here, if you go to that smiley face with a pen, we can start drawing things on our on our picture. We have different tools over here. We can also apply stickers and a text. So we can write a text over here. Press done. And this is how we can create a simple text. All right. Besides that, if you tap on these four circles, we have object eraser where we can remove objects from our photos. Lasso in order to cut out an object and just edit it um, without the background. We can use spot color and we also have color mix and style. So here in the color mix, we can adjust the color, the specific uh, parts or specific colors a little bit. So we have hue, saturation, luminance. And essentially that is it. Let's also see the style. So here, as you can see, we can create comic style, have watercolor and so on and so forth. Once you are done with the edit, we can press save over here in the top right corner. However, this will replace the original photo. So if you want to keep the original photo, you want to tap on these three dots and then save as copy instead. This will allow you to save this photo as a separate photo and uh, leave the original photo untouched. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye